Intel on this guy is sketchy at best. The cartel and the Bolivians call him El Comandante. Age unknown, birthplace unknown, real name unknown. An officer in Unidad, Bolivia's military police, El Comandante made a name for himself hunting down rebels. The rebels had something of a foothold in Media Luna until El Comandante and Unidad arrived in force. It was a slaughter. Rumor has it our boy personally took a few scalps as souvenirs. On paper, he's a lieutenant colonel. In reality, he wields the kind of authority reserved for legends. And he's been using that authority to put Unidad to work for Santa Blanca. But the way he's been insinuating Unidad into the cartel's operation should make Sueño worry. If it were up to him, Sueño wouldn't work with anyone from Unidad. His problem is the rebels. You can't fight what you don't know. And if there's one thing El Comandante knows, it's the rebels. Without him, Media Luna would be in rebel-controlled territory. Like all good frenemies, Sueño keeps a close eye on El Comandante, careful never to let down his guard. How's it going, everybody? Today we're going to be checking out the Unidad Conspiracy DLC for Ghost Recon Wildlands. Now, you're going to want to go into your game data, and you will see that it is ready to install right there. So you can go ahead and install it. And then once that finishes, we're going to close back out to the title screen. You shouldn't really have to restart this the game. Uh, soon stay. enough, though, Listen. you will be greeted Our up at the top right-hand corner uh, with a notification saying that Dense you've unlocked jungles. the content. Now, this content is only for people who've played the open and closed beta. And so far, that seems to be the only way to uh, unlock these missions. So there's a brand new Bouchon to fight and uh, about three missions, which is a little bit of a letdown considering the Peruvian Connection DLC. But here we're going to see some of the uh, exposition here. Bowman, this is Nomad. What have you got on Media Luna? That province is all Unidad. A thug in uniform calling himself El Comandante is considered top dog out there. He's assisting Santa Blanca with security, especially against the rebels. We have to break up this little romance between Unidad and Santa Blanca, but since El Comandante always wears a mask, we have no idea who he is. We'll look into that mystery for you and see if we can't make things uncomfortable for Santa Blanca along the way. So now we should be able to start up the first mission. We've got to find a way to break the secret alliance between Santa Blanca and Unidad. Start digging in Media Luna. Get me some intel we can use. All right, so it looks like we've got to go all the way up to the northwest of this spot here. So grab one of these conveniently placed bikes and I'm go on bike. cruising. This is definitely one of the nicer provinces. That canyon down there is, uh, is a really cool spot to check out. Uh, but we're almost uh, approaching the Unidad base here. This is it. Were you hoping for something fancy? It's El Comandante. I was expecting muscle. It don't got racing stripes, but it might have muscle under the hood. I suppose. Proceed with caution. Alright, so that car that just passed us was a uh, Santa Blanca drug runner. Um, they shouldn't. <laughs> Okay, we're good. So let's just throw up the drone and mark up a couple things. Uh, so it looks like we've got to interrogate uh, Captain of the Unidad base here. Is that an air defense system? So since everybody's looking really spaced apart, I think I'm going to switch to my pistol and uh, just try to take them out one by one. Hopefully they won't see each other drop, but here goes nothing. We're cool, we're cool. Why didn't they report it there? What happened? Just poke around the corner. Shit. Let's get down here. So these two guys over on the right, not entirely sure if they've seen me drop the first guy. But uh, we're also not going to take any chances either. And that's it. We're completely made at this point. So let's just run. Opening fire on these fuckers. Sniper's got us targeted. 
zona. Fuego discreción. Ahora. God damn it, the cartel sent reinforcements. Oh shit, that lead is flying a little bit close to the captain. We'll definitely have to make our way up there sooner rather than later. Hey man, sweet hiding spot. Get on up here and administer some cold, hard interrogation. Cooperate to the Saldra Pien. Yo, I got a weapons case here. Tell me something good or I blow a canal through your head. Tranquilo, tranquilo. I have something very good. El Comandante has taken a Santa Blanca Lieutenant for prisoner. He's using him for information on the Carter. El Comandante, he searches for the cartel weaknesses. Where's this prisoner now? He's in a convoy, being transported to headquarters. Alright, that's mission complete. Let's make like a tree and get the fuck out of here. Looks like there's a chopper nearby, so we'll uh, make our way over there. Dante's transporting a Santa Blanca prisoner by convoy. If we can get to this guy and cut him loose, he'll rat on El Comandante in a heartbeat. Yeah, the trip over to this convoy by helicopter is certainly an exercise in dodging missiles, so we'll just put it into the dirt here. Here and throw down a mine. Placing a mine for us, Akari. Got him down, coming in. This road may have been destroyed. That was awfully close. Okay, keep up, amigo. Unless you'd rather stay behind. Why the rescue, culero? I get the vibe you're gonna kill me anyway. Depends. You gonna be good? Shit! Let me go and I'll show you how good I am, puto! I love how Ubisoft added the ability to choose your vehicle drop-off. I asked the rebels to send over a vehicle for us. Hell yeah. Pinche puto! I'll fuck you up, cabron! Sure you will, amigo. What the hell you want with me? You're gonna kill me or what? That's up to you. You willing to carry a message back to the cartel for me? What do you want me to say? Tell your boots on shit. Tell everybody that'll listen. That El Comandante can't be trusted. He's looking for a way to stab the cartel in the back. Whatever you say. I'm gone. All objectives complete. We're done here. Let's keep moving. All right, so now that we're done that, I guess this is the grand finale coming up here. Let's just get back to the armored car and uh, wrap the whole thing up. Bowman, we just cut loose a cartel lieutenant. Told him to warn his boss that El Comandante's gunning for him. That ought to put some pressure on our guy, make him easier to track. You sure as shit got somebody's attention. Satellites tracking a hell of a lot of vehicles scrambling out of a Santa Blanca camp near you. 
Looks like the cartel's going after El Comandante. You got a location for us? I'm pushing coordinates to you now. Just one thing. I want to know who this fucker is once you've taken him down. Get me a clear picture of El Comandante's face and upload it so I can get an ID. Copy that. I'll try to keep him pretty for you. All right, so it looks like we're going to be walking into a firefight between the Santa Blanca and the Unidad. The cartel's going after El Comandante. This is our chance to take the bastard out and blame it on El Sueño's people. Kill El Comandante and get me a photo to ID him. Deploying drone. So we're getting Drone's jammed here, down. but uh, luckily jammed. if you have full upgrades uh, with your drone, you can kind of get out of the jammer's radius. Got some muzzle flash going on. Got SB trading shots with Unidad. Commandante's secret moves are out in the open. Our message got through. We got one last message to send. Let's move. I'm spotting another tango. And baby makes three. I got a target carrying submachine guns. The drone's crapping out. They must be jamming it. Uh, I think there's a sniper up above us here. Shit, nothing. Uh, okay, so Drone's let's whip out, out the binoculars here. So usually uh, the high priority target will be in this room, but uh, I guess he's walking around somewhere, so we'll have to look for him. Uh, actually, let's try and take out some of these snipers. Yeah, they're giving us some real trouble here. I've got eyes on El Comandante. Let's take this fucker out. Copy that. Uh, so it looks like he's just waltzed right underneath us here. Shoot through the floor. Nope. Uh, better angle. Okay. Probably have to wait for an angle on the wall here. Helicopter, get down. Oh shit! Shit! Oh no! All right, so here's uh, El Comandante, who's been totally mowed down by the AI squad mates while I was down. Uh, so let's Scooby Doo this shit. Bowman, I've got that photo you wanted of El Comandante's face. Sending him now. His name's Miguel de los Monteros. His father's a defense minister in La Paz. Looks like the big wigs in the capital sent Miguel to Media Luna. I'm guessing he had a secret mission to take over Bolivia's cocaine trade. Looks like we ruined the party for everybody. Something tells me the big boys in La Paz won't be happy with us. Alright, so there we go. That's uh, El Comandante killed. 
So that is the Unidad Conspiracy. Uh, I've got to say, with only three missions, it is a little bit short, especially when you compare it to the pre-order DLC, the Peruvian Connection. Uh, but here's the gun right here in the menu, El Comandante. We'll definitely be uh, shooting this off a little bit in a future video, but for now, thanks a lot everybody for tuning in, and we'll catch you next time.